here we can see the processor mining with all the cores running at 100% and we can see that the core temperature is around 82 degrees and GPU temperature 80 degrees switching to the new AEO we can see a big drop in the temperature down to 67 degrees in the CPU but we increase the temperature in the GPU by 2 degrees and I would expect that this of course is because of the AEO restricting a little bit of the airflow and keep in mind previously I had two 140mm fans in the front and I changed to a 240mm AEO so there is now just two 120mm fans uh, and they have the, the uh, radiator in front of them so the card will get a little bit less cooling playing Call of Duty Modern Warfare here in online map to like medium high settings we can see that the GPU temperature is 80 degrees with the old AU cooler and the CPU temperature is all the way up to 70 degrees here and uh, clocking down to like say 4100 millihertz and the average FPS is around 169 at this moment here and now we are going to switch to the new MSI AEO and we can see that the CPU temperature has now dropped to uh, only 55 degrees so also while gaming you will have a huge difference in temperature and we can see that clock speed actually on the CPU is a little bit higher I would expect that since it's running cooler um, and the GPU temperature at this moment is actually also lower uh, I'm not sure why but yeah uh, and we can see the average uh, is around 170 FPS so we didn't gain a lot of uh, frames per second but uh, I would say there's still a little bit of an increase and overall it's just good that the system is running cooler which also the way I've set up the fans um, makes my PC much quieter since they are CPU temperature uh, bound or uh, decided so thank you for watching